If you knew about all of the videos that I make up as I go that don't make it to YouTube. Here I am experimenting with um, onion, garlic, butter, and two ribeye steaks. I don't know why, but I keep thinking I'm going to add cream of mushroom soup to it. <laughs> I, just playing around. This is how I make a lot of the recipes I come up with. But uh, they don't always turn out great, so I don't always post them to YouTube. Time will tell. I ended up just doing a classic cream of mushroom soup. And uh, have the steaks in that now. And then I put some uh, jasmine rice in the microwave. Here's a trick on jasmine rice in the microwave though while I'm standing here. What I normally do on jasmine rice, like if the recipe calls for one cup of jasmine rice, I usually double the amount of water. So one cup of jasmine rice, two cups of water. In the microwave, I turn it on five minutes on high. When that shuts off, I then do 10 minutes at 50% power. When that shuts off, stir it up and then do it another two minutes on high. Your jasmine rice will come out perfect every time. I'll show you that when it's done. Using the method I just told you about making rice, five minutes on high, double the amount of water as the rice. So if you use one cup of dried rice, you use two cups of water. In the microwave, you microwave that on high for five minutes. Then when that shuts off, you reduce the power to 50% and microwave it for 10 minutes. When that shuts off, you put it for two more minutes on high. And that's kind of what you look like. You have perfectly fluffy rice. So, back to my recipe. There's a ribeye steak with cream of mushroom soup. Rice and cream of mushroom soup poured over top of it. Nom nom nom.